It's Jose Trujillo, the Williams greatest living artist, and Mucho Macho, the Uno Mas. Let's do another painting. Now, my friends, this is going to be this is going to be a another commission. This is another commission. American woman. Yeah, but I'm gonna say Mexican woman. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Mexican woman. Hmm. What you say, baby? Yeah. Totally. I'm saying to you, baby. Yeah, but but but. So this is a commission that I that I'm I'm working on here. Might as well see it. What's happening? What's happening, beautiful people of the Instagrams? Where are my beautiful people of the Grams? Where are my beautiful people of the Grams? By the way, those of you who are interested in a commission this size, I am offering them for $400 a piece. Okay, so there it is. There's my, there's my, uh, what do they call that? My, uh, my commercial. Enough said. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna run another commercial. That's it. Well, maybe, no, that's it. Well, maybe, nope. That's it. No more commerciale. Look how look how this genius works this this thing. Ooh la la. What's up, Werner? How's it going? What's happening, Spolanco? Polanco, what's happening? Dude, we even got a Shamuko. What's happening, Shamuko? So I have to do something like this. So this is a painting of a of a duck, duck, a, a boat, boat duck. Okay. So you gotta do it very calmly. Very calmly. That way you can get the, the that way you can get the things going on. Okay, if you know what I mean, jelly bean. Are those been untouched? American woman. Please. Oh, there's my boat duck. How's it going, Liz? Good to see you here. Parece japonés. Muy cierto, muy cierto. Por el minimalismo que tiene, sí, cierto. Y las montañas quizás atrás. Looks like Japanese, says Bill. Totally. Pretty much, pretty much. I hope you guys can see well because it, when it gets a little cold, it starts getting a little, a little dark. And I'm hoping that you guys are able to see uh, what's going on here. There's a little boat right here, just a little boat. Da, 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 
American woman. Look at that. Boom. Very cool. Very cool. See perfectly. See perfectly. Yes, we can. Si podemos. Si se puede. All right. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna I'm gonna get a little bit of red and a little bit of purple with a little bit of green, red, purple, and green. Okay, a little red, a little purple, a little green, and we're gonna make a very nice. It's almost like a gray, but it's a little gray purple right here. Look, the the, the birthplace of this was purple. our boardwalk right here for the oh, this is the dock right this is the dock well this part of the boardwalk I guess just follow along you guys follow along Look at that. Ooh la la. What's up? How's it going? Vinilo. Vinilo. Hola, Jose. Hola, como esta? Patrick. What's up? How's it going, Patrick? Okay, so that's how we start here with the, with the you know, we're going to start just like closing in. Just closing in on this thing. some other rails right here but we're gonna come back to those rails this is just to to get get it get things moving let's get some dark green we're gonna put it right down here look just dark green Add more blue to it. Slowly, right? We're gonna do this slowly. Too fast, then you may lose the magic. I know this from experience. I, I made that mistake many, many times. I made the mistake of too fast many times. One too many times. <laughs> Mexican woman. Look at that. Check it out. Okay, slowly. Okay, slowly. Slowly is better. Everything's better slowly. Slowly. Calmado. Calmado, muchacho. This is our tree here. This is our vegetation. Nothing hurts more than a, than a, than a, than moving faster than you need to. Nothing hurts more than that to an artist. Now, if you feel like you should speed up and you're feeling that that energy, do it. 
But if it comes out of stress, slow down. Because you're doing it all wrong. If you're all stressed out, you're, you're doing it all wrong. You want to do it calmly, look. Calmado, muchacho, calmado. They're good, they're good. Now we're gonna mix a little bit of yellow. Dude, I feel like Bob Ross. I'm like walking you guys through like the mixing. Mix a little bit of yellow, a little bit of red. And here we go, look. Ooh la la, we're gonna get that nice olive color. Ooh, it's almost like a hazel. A little bit more red, I wanted a little bit more red. I'm gonna get the more red. Calmly, calmly, calmly. Let the painting paint it, paint itself. Don't force the painting. Let the painting do the do the job. You see? See, you have to. Or it's almost like you're asking permission for it. It's a it's a little swing. Boom. Just like that. Now we're gonna go and we're gonna paint those little those little hills, those little mountains there. They look more like hills, they're not they're not so high, even though it looks like they're far away. They don't look I'm looking at a reference because this is a commission, so this is a specific place for someone. And So I am looking at a reference. I'm gonna show it to you though because it's not mine to show. But you can imagine. <laughs> the reference is, is the reference was provided by the by the patron, by the by the person commissioning me the painting. So I, I don't I never show the references. Um, I never show references, period, but especially when they uh, when they provide them. Da, 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 da. How's it going, Marina? What's up? Marina, how big is the canvas? The canvas is 16 by 20 inches. Again, my friends, the canvas is 16 by 20 inches, but I am I am offering commissions this size for $400. Okay, $400 a pop. Uh, I sell them for more than that, but you know, I do this kind of stuff. I do this kind of stuff. I, I run my specials. Da, 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 da. So if you have a picture of a vacation home, I don't know, you know, that kind of stuff. If you have a picture of uh, a portrait, you want me to do you, you want me to do it in this style? Um, or you just like one of my paintings and you're like, dude, I want I want one of your paintings, but I want it in this size. Can you do a variation of one of your paintings in this size? Boom, we'll do it and stuff. Look at that. Oh la la. How's it going? How's it going, people? What's happening? How's it going, Sylvia? I'm gonna start using my sexy ASMR voice. How's it going, luxury? Luxury sing silver. Murray knock. It's my it's my ASMR voice. That's as much as I, I'll do right now. I'll get back and I'll do some more ASMR.
Get out. So that's the thing about lakes and rivers. The water is so interesting. It, it, it loves to... It has character depending on the time of the day. All, all water has character because it's a reflection of everything that is happening. Not just in the sky, but the atmosphere. Around it. Environment. That's why Monet had so much fun painting water. I don't blame him. Good old Monet. Having all kinds of fun painting water. The trick to this thing is painting calmly and slow. But some people think I paint very fast, and I do, but I don't. As a matter of fact, if I am too fast, and I start moving too fast, I, I miss the spark. There's a spark happening. It's almost like the, 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 the gods are guiding my hands. There's a little spark happening, and if I, if I, if I start thinking too much, I lose it. And I have to go find that little spark all over again. It's a pain in the butt to find it all over again. Most artists are afraid of losing that spark. As a matter of fact, many artists don't like to don't like to stop painting because they're afraid they're going to lose that spark. But the, the spark doesn't come from painting. They're all mistaken about it. Look at that. Look at that blue. If you move a little too fast, you start losing it, you start missing it. It's better to move slow than fast. Look at that water. Warner says, where does the where does the spark come from? The spark comes from the present momento. The spark comes from from getting outside of your own mind, stepping stepping away from your mind. And so, so you embrace you embrace this little moment right here that we're having. You, know, you embrace everything. You embrace every little thing. When you're painting, you have to embrace everything. Oh, yeah. hmm? Can I put the rest? Can I put the baby again? Uh, give me a second, because I would have to go and open that. Or ask your mom if she wants to open the gate. They already got picked up, Daniel. No, that's not our. We're going to want to go play with the baby again. Yeah, that's what we want to do. We've been, uh, we've been uh, target practicing our room. It's getting pretty good. Okay. And so you can't move, you can't step out of time. We get tempted to step out of time, but you can't step out of time. Anytime you're trying to do something in a hurry way, in a, in, a, in a fast, in a hurry, in a go, 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 you're stepping out of time. So anytime that you step out of time, at a real time, you step, you step into mind-made time. Mind-made time, mind -made time will get you to re feel powerless. Be in the moment, yeah. Yeah, mind make time gets you to feel very, very powerless, and and it gets you to feel uh, even irritated. This is why artists experience irritation sometimes. 
or they feel like they don't have um, they don't have creativity it's not that you don't have creativity it's that you've you've stepped away from from real time from the moment you're in mental time now Men mental time always will always feel insufficient hey dudes dudes suck it up dudes Look at that. Step, step into real time. It feels difficult because it's very narrow. It's a very narrow door. Real time is a very narrow door. So it feels very difficult sometimes for our minds to recognize real time. My mom, did my mom bring my medicine? Look at that. Ooh la la, look at that water. Do you see the, 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 the magic of that water? Ooh la la, that water can only exist in real time. In mental time, it, it would look like shit. See that? You gotta do a little bit of breathing too to get into into real time. Real time is where those of you who have a loving grandmas, that's where the loving grandmas live in real time. Those of you who have newborns, newborns live in real time too. Little children. That's why grandparents love being around children. Because they're, they're learning how to live in real time. They, they, they learn from children. Little children. Little, little, little children. Little, little toddlers. Babies and toddlers. Live in real time. They start growing up and then, and then they, they get out of living in real time. They, they get in psychological time. Psychological time is, is, is where anxiety is born and all that other bullshit. Look at that. What's up, Anish Chanel? Come on, Stas Chanel. So we're using this color right here. Get in there. Slowly. Slowly, calmly. Full of attention. Nothing is, we're not trying to do anything, so everything gets done. Because we're not trying to do anything. We're just... <laughs> we're just here.
for any reason you ever feel like a little agitated or whatnot, hold your brush right before the canvas or sometimes just touch it. Sometimes just touch it like this and leave it there a few seconds. Don't move it. This will get you to, to settle your dust. Yeah, the, my, the, the mental activity will, will come down and all of a sudden you're going to feel compelled to move. And then again, when you feel like you're thinking a lot or you start feeling a little anxious, whatever, you stop again. Yeah, you just create contact. Don't move it. Nothing. Just create contact. This just create stillness. And then you move again. When you feel tempted, every time that you feel tempted when you're when you're painting to overthink, just create contact with the with the brush. Just be still. Be still. If you're physically still, you can be mentally still too. It, 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 they, they, they work hand in hand. Somehow they work together. What's that in the water? Okay, so this is a dock. This is a dock. Um, my my representation of a duck things happening little things happening we're not really sure what any of these things are in the distance in the distance things look very very abstract objects especially especially small objects look very abstract I'm doing everything with the same brush, okay? I'm doing everything with the same brush right now. You don't have to, of course not. Uh, again, this is a, for those of you who don't know, this is a commission. This is not something that I'm going to list on, on eBay or, or my platforms. It's just a commission. This is going straight, as soon as it dries, it goes straight to the, to the owner. From time to time, I, I record myself doing commissions. Uh, most of the time, I don't like to because, I don't know, I, I kind of use that time to listen to books or something, but, but sometimes I record them. Maybe it's a reminder to people out there that I, that I also do commissions. That way they don't forget. <laughs> <laughs> that way they don't forget and I still keep I keep getting commission jobs. Look at that. This is oil, it's oil oil on stretch canvas. And now now what we're gonna do is gonna start working on that sky on the on the upper part. And and, and that's that's a bit blue, right? It's a bit blue right here. But again look, every brush stroke every brush stroke is nothing. But caressing the canvas. If that canvas, if that brush is not making love to that canvas, you're doing it wrong. Forget about where it lands. It doesn't matter. It's it's the condition in 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 which it lands. It's not where. It's not what the, what color you're using. It's it's is the condition the 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 energy. This is why a lot of people, when they see me paint, they ask me what color was that, or this, or that. It doesn't matter. This, it, it, this contact right here is everything. 
But contact is everything. That verse, that verse needs to be needs to be caressing and making love to that canvas. Whatever you're using. Okay, Mika. Look at that. You see that? You enter, you enter the, the the canvas like entering a temple. A temple. You take off your hat and, and possibly take off your shoes. You're entering a sacred place. What I mean is you enter it you enter calmly. You're almost asking permission to enter. And then everything everything starts stacking in place. I'm not suggesting you paint this way. This, this is what I've discovered about painting. To me, this is painting. Every bend of the brush is purposeful. Not because it means something, but because it's, but because it's done with full intention. Not because there's some deep meaning to it. There probably is. We can philosophize all night about this. We can make a, an encyclopedia. We could make a whole collection of philosophies about this. I'm sure artists have done it, philosophers, critics have done it, but I'm not interested in that as an artist when, when, I, when I talk about this stuff. I'm more interested in, did you make contact? Was, was your brush truly there on the canvas or were you in your mind when you were painting? This is the energy that people that people long for in anything, whether you're making a sandwich or you're or you're making a painting or you're building a home or you're talking to someone, this is the energy that people long for. The energy of presence. Look at that. Everything else is bells and whistles in life. You're talking to someone who loves you or who you love. It's the attention, it's not the words. The words the words mean nothing. It's the attention. Is the person paying attention in the conversation? Are they looking at you like like uh Like an artist is looking at a canvas, like a cat is looking at a mouse hole. Pa painting is no different. It's, it's, everything is the same. It's, it's the art. The art of living is yes. attention. Look at that. There we go. why I keep it so simple. I, I wouldn't have it any other way. Once you start figuring out that the whole trick of the whole the thing is attention, everything makes sense. There it is. 
Hi. You're welcome. Thank you so much, Liz. I gotta get some. I gotta get some food in my system now. There it is, my friends. Simple as that. Just like that. I'll take this thing off there. And then there is my duck. Thank you so much, everyone. Stay well and sophisticated, my friends. I will be talking to you guys later. I gotta get some food. These people already got uh, got some chipotle. and I can't wait to get my... My teeth sinked into some of that food because I'm hungry. Take care, my friends. Oh, very nice. Thank you so much. I'll talk to you guys later. And if you guys have any questions about this or uh, the commissions that I do, you can always uh, DM me, send me a message. Bye-bye.